Welcome back YouTube to more Elden Ring. I'm just teleporting back to the bonfire that we found last time after buying 90 arrows. Because I would like to get to the big tree. I know that's not what I was aiming to do when I first came to this area, but I want to see if I can get there. And there is a rickety bridge down here with some kind of weird corpse in front of it that 100% is going to get up once I get near it. This is a bit too far of a drop even on the horse though, I think. What is that lying there? Oh, it was poop. Oh, I can just target him from up here. Isn't that just one of those things from the... The other... Oh. What is that? No, that's not what I wanted. That's what I wanted. Tar Come on, I had the target. There we are. I have the high ground, Anakin. Oh no, my one weakness. Slightly sidestepping to the left and right. he armed with? He's got a knife and something. Those are definitely suspicious looking flowers. I think I can get down here on the horse. Nope. Stepping back. I am still going down there, but I might as well try and kill this thing from a distance if I can. No, stand still, I won't shoot you. Not worth even... I don't think it was worth the number of arrows I used, honestly. What? Alright, so you can't double jump at the last second to survive those kind of falls. I didn't know that. That was silly. In that case, I don't think I can go down there from the direction I came from, because I'm pretty sure there's no smaller drop. Where was that? Yeah, over here. he respawn? He does. Oh, you know why he's there? He's going to get up when you're halfway across the bridge and cut it. That's why he's there. Or vice versa if you have to come from that direction. So that, yeah, that's... I, I feel like that would normally not be fatal, so I think that's fatal because they don't want you to go that way. And there's a big jump there. Uh, I could drop down there, drop down there. That would take me over there and I would skip the bridge entirely. That doesn't look like as far a drop. Uh, this looks a little iffy. There's a, oh, there's very clearly bats waiting to jump you if you try for that bug there. Oh, too far. Well, we're dead. <laughs> oh, just a casual 2,000 damage. I wonder how much health the horse has. I think it is like a 1,000. I think it is doable to do that. I don't know how long I want to attempt it for. I 
Like if I did jump across there and made it, I would jump over to that, but I don't think there's enough distance from there to there to live. Even with the horse double jump. And as I say, there's an ambush way and there's like six bats, there's three on each side. That does look fallable though, let's try that. Do those bats that do that lightning? <laughs> Here. There must like the lightning is always so localized that there must be something or someone doing it. And I don't think it's random weather because it only ever hits one particular location. Two, three. There's still three bats. I don't really want. Oh, okay. It definitely does damage because it just hit the loot bug. <clears throat> Maybe it is just localized lightning. I don't know. Is this a fail drop? I, I honestly can't tell, so there's only one way to find out. I also see a torch or something below here. He lived! Okay, it has 1400 HP then. The hell is this? I don't know what this, this blue line denotes other than the lightning <laughs> abruptly changing. Oh, you know what? It was probably the anti-horse line, right? Mornfang Tunnel? Flashbacks of Demon Souls. I can take the elevator, but there's also a path there. I hear whispering. And mining? Ooh, I, I might be able to upgrade my katana again. I can only do it one more time without finding the blacksmith, but still. And there's Dark Souls muscle memory there, slash Demon Souls, I guess. Oh, there's a, a touch grass. It's a death pit for sure. And a summoning statue. The hell is that? Hello, whatever you- oh, you've got bird legs. I see. So you've chosen death. There's a- is that a purple item? Actually, you know what? I don't need to ask. That is a purple item, and he looks special compared to the other ones. He's got wings. They're reusing the, the... Ooh, I pressed the wrong button. I live, bitch. Oh, hello. Old fine. So they're like, they're minding the miners. Soft cotton crafting material. Judging by the picture on the left. Harpies, but like man harpies. So that means that one's an archer, they'll be close range base. If I hit the ranged one, the other ones will probably aggro. These might be the like the miners and demon souls, so let's test. Yep, if I don't bother them, they don't bother me. I guess we'll test the theory. Let's stay on I can't summon hell.
Oh, you made me hit the other one. And now I accidentally... Oh, God. You know what? They're pretty weak. There, I said it. You're weak. Come on. Changing the tune from dual wielding still confuses me now and then. Oh, you've got cool arrows. I'm trying very hard not to hit the mining guy. I don't think I've got good damage for them, assuming it's like Demon Souls. You'd need a crushing weapon. <clears throat> so I accidentally fell, so we're down here whether I like it or not. But the purple item should be grabbable now, so let's do that. Yoink. Oh, another one of them. Okay. Still don't know what to use for. He's snoring. Sorry, little one. Somber smithing stone. I mean, they've probably got a chance of dropping crafting materials, so I'm going to have to kill them. But not until I'm done exploring. If they're not aggressive, we'll leave them alone for now. I think that's the way I was supposed to come down, so let's have a look over here. Through the big tunnel. You think? Also, some of them might be sneakily aggressive, like in Demon Souls, like once you walk past, maybe? No? A big gate implies a boss. I'm trying to see through the gaps and oh, there we go. Uh, I don't see anything in there at all, honestly. But I'm going to presume it's a boss, so we're going to finish exploring first. Because I don't want to have to kill all those enemies again if it is a boss to do a run back to. Sorry, I just need to test. Yeah, you are tanking against my damage type. Explosive stone clump. Is that safe to handle? Yellow ember. Nope. Found in lands afflicted by frenzy. And there it is. Explodes when thrown together, inflicts fire damage. Okay. Oh yeah, new test, are they aggressive to me now I've killed one? No. Okay. You're snoring. Ah, no, are these ones going to be aggressive because they're not working? Have to test. Yes, yes, they are. Now. Pickaxe. Finally, a dex weapon. Staunching... Oh, that's the bleed cure. There's a lot of snoring, but it's from above me, I think. I wonder if it's only because it's nighttime in game that they're snoring, and if I was here during the day, they'd be awake. There's one sleeping there, but that one over there is alive. And there's one right there also sleeping. I think I'm just going to grab the item and run. So let's see what's over here first. A 
house with a chest. And another resting man that's going to turn aggressive. Oh, he's he's got special glowy rocks. Maybe they won't see me if I just sneak in. There's one sleeping in here. I mean you no harm, sir. I'm here for your loot. The aggro. High frames, bitch. Oh, well, exalted flesh. I already have that. Is the one with the glowy back then, aggro. Never mind, he's up. I think he might know. His first hints were when he heard his two friends dying. Oh, he actually calmed down. Guarding another chest. Okay, there's one through there. He's guarding a body. Large glintstone scrap times two. More somber stones. Okay, I'm gonna try and sneak grab the item up the stairs and then just run and see the boss. I've only got two heals left, so it's not gonna be uh, a good first try, but that's okay. Again, assuming that the big door is a boss, but it looks very boss-like. Stealth 100. Yeah, so if I needed to do a quick run back, well obviously there's stuff up there I've missed. But if I want to do a quick run back, it's just as simple as falling where I fell last time and running in. Although it might be easier to just fall from there. Door opening animation! And summon, but I've got no MP with which to do so because I've been doing my samurai attacks. Oh, hello. Scally misbegotten. He's roly polying! Hello, sir. You have a very long wind up. And a very, very slow attack speed. Oh, and a follow up. If I had full Estes, this does not look like a fight that would be a problem. As it is, though. He's so slow, it's throwing me off. Oh! Oh, he bled! Son of a bitch, please die. Never mind, it was fine. The bleed definitely saved me there. I got a rusted anchor. Rusted anchor. Oh, is that it down there? No. Uh, weapon? Maybe? It might actually be a weapon. Oh, it is. 
It is a, well, strength dex, focusing on strength, needs 26 strength to wield. Barbaric Roar. Okay. So not a weapon for me, but that's fine because we stumbled on this by accident. Well, there's still more to find in this dungeon though because I, I accidentally fell down early. Where was the... Wait, was there even a, a bonfire here? Yeah, I think. No, there wasn't, was there? That's no good. There's bats hanging off the walls, so I can't go that way safely. I have no heals left. Yeah, I'm just going to have to teleport then. Yeah, consider the ex I can teleport back to the dungeon entrance, that's fine. Actually, I'll just I'll do just that. I was going to say let's go back onto the, what I was supposed to be doing, but no. Not yet. Let's teleport back. Yeah, perfect. Actually, what I should do is check how many shards I have. Because if I can upgrade my weapon, that's more damage, so why not? Eight is probably enough. Let me go do that real quick. And then that means I can't do any more until I find the blacksmith. Because I think it's set up to plus three by myself. Yeah, okay. Yep. I mean, I might as well do the bow, I suppose. This map is huge. It looks like Odin Chapel from Bloodborne. Mmm, that's some tasty damage. Alright, so is there even any items up here? There's another tunnel across there. I'm suspicious of that breaking. just a jump across there and that's where that room of the three is I think I actually got all the items see this was a short area I mean I actually know there might be more to from the elevator but it had flavor weird flavor but flavor well let's check on the way back up actually see if there was any other little side passages I missed on the way down. Classic Demon Souls elevator. Probably the same asset, it's slightly shrunk. Oh, I think I saw something down there. Yep, there's a tunnel there. Wait, no, that tunnel there is the one I went in. Let me check again. I definitely went in that tunnel. This side. No, I think we're good. Those flowers down there are probably poison, so I'm not sure I want to go over there. Wee! 
That did not send me up far enough. That suspiciously sent me just far enough that I bet what I said would happen would happen. But that guy's going to get up and cut the bridge. Oh. Hello, whatever you are. You appear to have a tree for a head. I can't tell which direction you're looking. No, you have a tree in your back. Oh, okay, there's a ruin down there. I know I have too many items in my quick bar. Okay, let's see how strong these guys are. You, fight me. Yes, hello. I'm invading your land. Come fight me. Tarnished golden sunflower. <coughs> that one looks slightly different. Oh, wait, no, no, it's just active. They jump! Combos are always one more than you expect. Row number one of Bloodborne. And this is... I don't even know where this is leading me. To the, the tip of the island, I guess. It looks like there's a statue or something there. I was suspicious of an area that looks nice. That tree I saw before, like that tree looked get like get toable, whereas that one doesn't. What is this? There's a progression procession rather up ahead. Is it more of these flame worshipping weirdos? That's the that's the exact group you spawn if you do the that particular scroll. Yeah, fire hop and not fire sexy. There's a ghost at the door and a checkpoint inside there, so let's get that. And work out where the hell we are. Church of the Pilgrimage. Okay, touch grass. Praise the sun, sort of. Ooh, better Estus, you say? So that's why you want to find these ruined churches. They have Estus related stuff. I don't think my HP bar is big enough now. I need to get some levels in that. Are you talking really slowly or just talking in like ghost whispers? Oh, there's a side mission. Oh, hello. Sorry, I didn't even see you there. I just wanted to visit the graveyard and be peaceful. I had nothing... I had no ill intent. Ugh. As I was saying, that's a side quest pointer over there. Or side dungeon, you know, whatever. There's an item over there. Gilded Iron Shield. It's a small shield. 69 defense against physical. Holy damage as well. It's pretty decent. Guard boost is okay. And it counts as a small shield. 
boosts holy damage negation. Yeah, it is pretty high. It's that, oh yeah, it's the only one that's higher is that one. Which I can't even use. Oh wait, that's the starting island. That's why that statue is so large. Okay. Remember when I was going to go in that castle? <laughs> And how long ago that was? So that's that's the first area over there. Which I do need to go back to because there's that horse boss. I can pro well no the the problem was never the damage I was doing it was how much damage he did to me. Alright, again, back to trying to get to that tree for some reason. And that statue up there, I think. Yeah, that is a side dungeon pointer, for sure. Don't know if we've been down there or not, either. That is very... Oh! That's alive because it's moving. Also, it was on the loading screen just now. Shadow of the Colossus. It's a turtle building. Okay, that's why this area is massive and open. I pressed the wrong button, sorry. <laughs> Old habits. Oh, I expected that to point down. It's pointing into the rock over there. Yeah, look at that huge area with like nothing in it. That's for f oh, that's another ruined church though. I could just run past him and get to it maybe. Okay, there's probably a dungeon checkpoint or bonfire. I mean, so I can get that. That's super close by. Pointing over here somewhere. Why is everything tasting like red? Red and lag. Oh, I see the door, in fact. Oh, that's a sneaky door. Yeah, it has the same the same aesthetic as the other two did. Tombsward Catacombs. Touch grass. You still have got on me? Eh, that's fine. Alright, we will come back here, but I want to check out turtle building first. Or more specifically, I want to see if I can run past it to the, the what I think is a ruined church behind it. Assuming it's aggressive, but that's the natural stance. Oh, there's something glowing in the road down there too. There's a lot of things glowing, whatever these are. They are people. They are ghost people, maybe being controlled by the bell it has where its testicles should be. Are you talking about an ATSD? Actually, it looks like the home base of the GoBots. There's a reference not many people are going to get. I mean, you know harm, I mean, you know harm. They mean they harm, they also have no heads. But they're not on horses, so I have nothing to fear. They really do be up in the shadow of Colossus, huh? It seems in 
different my my presence and has no health bar. Interesting. Oh. Hello, sir. You're surrounded by kunai? Okay. Oh, there's enemies guarding this one. But there is a bonfire because I saw the light. Fourth touch of Marika. Bear Estes again, you say? I definitely don't have enough HP to take advantage of this. So be careful at the door because there's two enemies. And this is the edge of the island. The damn tree is like a rainbow. <laughs> the closer you get, the further away it seems. This background to the same place, yeah, it is. Ding dong, ding dong. No, this looks different actually. These, I think, they're still spooky ghosts, but it looks like a poison swamp. And I can summon here. Which bane ruins? No, oh, it's not poison. Hang on, maybe my horse is immune. No, it's not poison. Okay, well, let's summon the old demi-humans and have a little explore down here. I'm going to go back to that dungeon after this, though. I was just curious if there was a second thing around. They've got multiple arms. Also, it is a goddamn poison swamp. Go, my summons. Go. I'll stand here and watch. By which I mean be an archer. They're wearing, like, they're wearing bell cages as armor. Also, they're basically bone wheel skeletons. <laughs> okay, sorry, I was distracted by how silly they were. I'll have to kill you now. But you look funny. Don't disappear, my friends. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. Cuckoo Glintstone? Oh, are they losing health? Did they get poisoned? I don't think their health bars are going down. I mean, I do have some of the items that cure poison, but ugh. They've aggroed something, or rather something has aggroed them. They're doing fine. I'll go in once they're dead. And I just want to see if there's any stairs down, although I don't think there would be considering this is a swamp, but who knows. Hello, kitty. They are the best summon I've had so far, because they get stuff done. Oh, can I stand on this and not get poisoned? I can. Aha. Although I think it is only the large one that does damage, but still. The others distract. They're doing okay. Granted, it's only the big one and two half-dead small ones left. Uh, my horse? Oh, my horse is immune. 
Or maybe it has its own separate poison health bar, I suppose. Uh, what the fuck are you? Ah! Yeah, you killed them, all right. You killed them dead. Actually, no, you didn't. They're still alive. There is stairs. That large one is pretty damn tanky. Yeah, that was weird. A giant ball made of faces coming out of the, the floor. Please have a bonfire down here so I don't need to run past that all the time. <clears throat> or have a person slash thing? Ambush shard, it's a spell, I think. <laughs> Is your head made of guacamole? I swear it. And yet you persist. She's iced to the wall. Yeah, I'm just wearing a cat head, lady. I don't know what's happening, really. Okay, she's repeating, but she says because maybe she can't see. See, I want to try and free her, but I'd probably accidentally kill her. She's not saying anything, she's repeating. Is there a button to release her or something? Oh, maybe hold a torch near her? The torch probably- oh, she might die in one hit though, that's the risk, I don't want to risk it. Um, can anyone tell me if I can safely hit her to free her with this? I don't want to accidentally kill her. She refuses to look up and see that I'm not one of those frothing degenerates. I'm a normal degenerate. No idea. Yeah, she's not looking. Let's check the thing we picked up just to make sure it is a spell. It's possible she would only talk to a mage if she is mage related. Strike from behind with a projectile fired from distance. 23 int. Okay. Sorcerers were assassins. You an assassin lady? I'm gonna leave you for now because I don't want to accidentally kill someone that might be important. Although if she is an assassin, maybe it's better that I don't free her. Maybe hopefully that face thing. Well, I mean, I, I could just run past honestly to get down there again. It's not so bad. Did miss an item back here. Marionettes. Oh, they're called marionette soldiers. Okay, that makes sense. There's also a ton of those weird zombie things on the beach. Oh, and houses over there, actually. Remember when I was going to go to that dungeon I found? I still will. Oh, the flashbacks to Cossum. Hello, turtle. Or something calls. Oh, there's a bloody bonfire down here as well. Well, at least it's super close to that lady. Oh, and there's a merchant here too. 
he is a different Santa Claus. He has a yellow hat. Isolated merchant. Well, he's very colourful. It's been an age since I've seen a customer. Who says I'm a customer? I might be here to rob you. At the end of the <clears throat> a lantern attached to the waist to look. Oh, they did put the bloodborne thing in. I wonder if it also sneakily takes away your stamina. Hmm. <clears throat> Even as the same description. So it's 1800. He's got one of those rare atria leaves. He's got one of those keys. Lost ashes of war. Used to duplicate ashes of war. He's got the Zweihander. 19 strength, 11 dex. Arrow, great arrow, bolts, ballista bolts, sacrificial twig. Will be lost on death in place of runes. Oh, neat. Note imparting knowledge in brief. Walking mausoleum. How the hell do I read these things? I've been buying a bunch of them, and that one's clearly about the bell tolling thing. Have a safe journey. Journey. Your donkey looks ill, sir. Right. There must be a way to read these things. Because they don't go into this menu. Ah, here we are. Uh, not so to stop the mausoleum stride, you'll need to clean up around its feet first. So I've been buying hints this entire time that I didn't need really for most situations. I've been wasting resources. Oof. Flask of Wondrous Sisic? It's in the third church north. Wait, I've been to the third church. Cross the highway bridge and follow the animal trail north. Uh, someone lurks among the waypoint ruins on the roads through Limgrave. Slay the diamond human mob leader first and the rest will lose hope and run away. Land squirts are soft when they touch the ground and poison will cause them to rupture. Yeah, I'll have to remember that for next time, because I want to quickly go look at that dungeon I got. But the the third church, north of Mistwood. Because I don't know what that means, and I want to see what that is. So there's no point in me running. I was, I was going to run up and hit the walking church thing. But it sounds like it won't, it won't be uh, gettable until you kill all his ghost followers. Which I don't really feel like doing right now. Also, I've kind of lost sight of it. Where is it? Over there. I hear it, but I don't see it. I also... is this where I was before? I don't think I came over here. This... I think this being here means there's a boss. Because this is an optional respawn point, right? I hear screaming up there. Yeah, it's definitely screaming. What the? These people just popped in when I got up here. That's coming from over in that direction. You're coming all the way over here, huh? Alright, let me see your patrol path. That's definitely a lot of screaming. That's uncomfortable to hear. Yeah, I think they're going to see me as soon as I crest this hill, so I want that horse to be quite far away. I don't think it's that group of guys by the crucifixions, unless the ones on the sticks are alive. Okay, you're very unobservant. Excellent. Oh, the horse is already coming back, though. Yeah, this is the... oh, there is a hole there. I can't do it in a single jump. A horse jump, maybe. It's 
stealth level 100. No one ever expects the horse. Oh, hello. Nice night. Trap! Screw you. Can I use this? Sadly not. I think it maybe maybe it is just the folk on the, the crucifixes that are screaming. Now let's heal to full. Uh, uh, hello, sir. I was just about to go down, but maybe if the other one's aggroed, I should wait a second. I want to follow the sound of screaming. <laughs> He's walking around somewhere. I can hear him. I think I missed him. Well, if you were hoping for ballistic support, you are going to be disappointed. It is these making the noise. There is no way that killed that horse, and so they must have a stagger limit. Yeah, it didn't kill it. How are you screaming? You're... Oh, you are bleeding. Okay, you are alive. That's disgusting. That's just where they have the screaming corpses. I wonder if they are meant to be screaming like that. Hello, oh, penguins. Have I killed any yet? Oh, I have now. No, I have not. There's a thing down here. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's seen me. Oh, it's a bat. All right, never mind. bats all over here. I've totally lost where the the giant church bell thing was. So that's a big tentacle monster with smaller ones around it. A couple of flies. And a loot bug as well. Oh, there we go. We're getting near it. I can hear it. Oh, that's the top of him there. Yeah, there he is. So he expects you to kill his ghost ads and then he'll probably aggro get a boss music and health bar going. Alright, but I did say I'd check out that dungeon I found before I stop, because we're getting near stop time. Where the hell was it though? That's the fourth church. Chat, where was that dungeon I unlocked? Was it oh it was the Tombsward Catacombs. So that's the third church up. No. I could have sworn I found the third church of what's her name? Apparently not. Hmm. Either way. That was definitely the dungeon. We're probably not going to have time to finish it, but we can at least take a little look. <clears throat> it's probably just more of the gargoyles, so. though. Yeah, here we are. Pardon me. The fog wall immediately? skeleton. Maybe it's not gargoyles then. That was the old classic skeleton spawn. Oh wait, I can put in a daily. Uh, just to get access to one room? How many of them do I have? Uh, it's the broken... I forgot what they're called. Probably in key items. I've got two. Hmm... 
Like, that might be a really good item sitting there. Who knows? That's all you're opening it for, I think. Screw it, I'll try it. We can always buy one from a merchant, I think. I think I saw one. Hello, sir. You are not my friend. You're also very tall. Nomadic Warriors Cookbook number nine. All right, maybe that was worth it then. I don't know if I can craft the stuff, but that wasn't even connected to whatever's in the dungeon. But I want to see if I oh, actually I can do that from here, can I? Is that new? No, I don't think that's new. That's new, I think. Rancer pot. Well, thank you, Arm Rad, for fifty-six months with a tier one sub. Catchphrase to you too. I've been using some stealth tonight. Surely it didn't just give me that. Throw to spawn vengeful spirits. Does sound pretty cool. I need human bone shards to use it though. No, the meats are from, like I did get them off camera, but no, I, I they were there before. Because I went to merchants and spent some cash between streams. I saw something walking around there. So that's the ball store, it's lagging. Oh, it is just, it's a dungeon of skeletons. Uh, it's a welcome change to the gargoyles, honestly. Might be famous last words. We'll see. That's alive. That one there. He was going to use pyromancy. You're not alive. You are alive. Okay, yeah, I thought so. Whoa, that's, that, the game is stuttering so bad. I do have a cat head now, yes, I took it from a dead gargoyle. And I asked chat which one did they prefer, and they chose this. Is that thing alive up there? No, that's the back of the switch I need, I think. Hello, skeleton. Both of you are archers, huh? He's rolling. Oh, there's a lot of them. Okay, rolling isn't enough to stop them respawning. Neither is getting a crit, as it turns out. I was going to say, why do the skeletons bleed? And then I realized, it's my blood. <clears throat> that arrow got me right in the upper shoulder blade. Or upper arm, I should say. Can I summon people? No, I can't. Okay. It feels fitting to have the sorcerer for this section. Is that fire again, or is that something else? Sounds like fire. You're getting up. You're definitely getting up because I can't interact with you. That is not the one I thought. I don't know where he came from. Exactly the same turn as that other dungeon. This, 
Oh, I was going to run in, but then it stuttered. Yeah, I don't know what I'm supposed to do either. I just run around and stuff happens. Here we get up. Yeah. I found a room full of skeletons. Oh, hey, I was talking about those. Oh! Hang on a second, you can go up there. Sneaky. If that skeleton hadn't been there, I wouldn't have known that. Are you supposed to fight the giant? No, you're absolutely not. No. I mean, I'm sure you could and I'm sure people have, but you absolutely should not know. Some of these are getting up, it just depends which ones. I don't think I can prematurely trigger them. I think I have to go past the point at which they come to get you. I know there is a path back the way to search as well, but this seems probably like how they've hidden the switch. Could be wrong. Oh wait, no, that's a slightly different colour. That one's getting up for sure. And he's... Oh, there he goes. I like that he taps as if he has a helmet. He doesn't have a helmet. I don't know if Mimics are in this game and nobody the answer, because I don't want to know. Oh, you can tell them in PM if you want. That's okay. Yeah, that was an instant question, I know. I'm doing this weird run because I'm trying to see if I trigger anyone else. I saw the switch though, so we have gone the right way. one try at the boss before I stop but I am going to go check that other path real quick because it could be another talking nut and those are much more important than loot or boss kills you're getting up you're getting up but if I grab the item and run, I don't need to care. Thank you! I got the best one. Can't have killed them. Well, they'll revive, but whatever. Oh yeah, I found the flail as well. Hang on. So, let's see. Hello is fun. Please help is fun. Jellyfish has a purpose. These ones are kind of... These sucked compared to these. So, let's get rid of them. I love the faces on them, too. It's like a moldy pumpkin. Hello. Hello. PC version needs a mod that changes it back to the sounds from um, Dark Souls 2 specifically, but... That's okay.
Yeah, I used one Estus. I should probably rest, because there's, there's like nothing in my way, so yeah, sure. Well, those skeletons maybe, because I opened up that door, but I can run. Oh, they didn't respawn. Oh, no, they did. They're there. No, it's going to be Cat Statue 3.0. Oh, on that note, let's summon in the Demi-Humans, because they seem pretty cool. It's a cemetery shade. Not a, not a cat statue. I don't like how he's just standing there. Oh. Go back to Kingdom Hearts. Wait, that's the tree monsters from Bloodborne. Ow, it's fine. It doesn't have that much HP because those those do shit damage, <laughs> and it's already lost that much. Okay, I, I shouldn't have summoned them. They're going to make her a cakewalk, but that's okay. Oh, unless I get blood lost again. Go back to blood burn. Luf, luf, the headless. <laughs> it's slightly yellow. Does that mean it's rare? I probably don't have the MP to use it. Let's see. Let's get rid of. I don't want to get rid of any of these, especially not him. He's the strongest thing in the game. Uh, let's see. 104. Pretty sure I can't use it. How much is my max FP? 71. Maybe I should put a level or two into the FP amount. That's pretty cool. Let's just grab all these. Yeah, that summon of those demi-humans is way too useful. I've been pretty sure I would have lost for sure, but just from the blood build up, blood build up, not blood build up alone. But we managed to get it done. I probably yeah got enough for a level. Let's see how much one level gives in terms of total number of FP. Which is mind presumably. It gives you three. Three? That's that's not worth it, unfortunately. Yeah, that's that's for mages. I'm not strong enough to wield that. It's a shame. Yeah, let's get to 20 decks next, I think. And if you want to see whatever the name the headless, either watch someone playing a mage or play a mage. But that was fun though, and another side dungeon done. <laughs>